Sally Challen is a British woman who gained significant attention for her involvement in a high-profile legal case in the United Kingdom. In August 2010, Sally Challen was convicted of murdering her husband, Richard Challen, in their family home in Surrey, England. She used a hammer to kill him. At the time, the case was widely reported as a hammer attack. During her trial, the court heard that Sally Challen had suffered years of emotional and psychological abuse from her husband. The defense argued that she killed him as a result of this coercive control and that she was suffering from diminished responsibility due to her mental state at the time of the incident. In June 2011, Sally Challen was sentenced to life imprisonment with a minimum term of 22 years. However, the case took a significant turn in 2019 when the Court of Appeal quashed her murder conviction. It recognized that the evidence of her history of abuse and coercive control was not properly presented during the original trial, and her conviction was unsafe. In March 2019, instead of facing a retrial for murder, Sally Challen pleaded guilty to manslaughter on the grounds of diminished responsibility. The court accepted her plea, and her sentence was reduced accordingly. She was released from prison in April 2019, having served around nine years of her original sentence. Sally Challen's case drew considerable public attention and became a symbol of the complexities of domestic abuse and its impact on the legal system. Her story contributed to a growing awareness of coercive control as a form of domestic abuse and sparked discussions about its recognition in the UK's legal system.